Hello my soccer universe. Well, searching online for deals is an amazing thing and will happen in here in Austria is an amazing place for that. Case in point, and I'm wearing this 9495 Ajax shirt for a reason. I found two shirts from the same seller uh, for a ridiculous 20, including shipping from that period. Now, full disclaimer, one of these shirts I already have in my collection in a slightly different configuration. And as I'm ha I have broken the seal here, but have have opened. I'm not 100% sure that they're original, but from all that I could tell and from the communication with the seller, I'm fairly convinced that those are originals. And yes, one of them has a flaw. That is maybe the one thing that is, but I, the seller I think was selling one for 10, the, uh, the other one for, yeah, both for 10. And I, I said, I'm going to buy both, can I have free shipping? And when you see the shirts, this is an amazing deal. An absolutely amazing deal. Now the way that I see it is, uh, since I have of one of the team already this jersey, I want to see how those two can compare, uh, because I don't think there's a makes sense for me to keep both of them. And for the other team, I already have way too many jerseys uh, than I would ever like. Um, and since it was a good price, and if the flaw can be fixed, which I think there is a way probably to get to get around, I think one could make actually some money off of these because 20 invested i think i could sell at least one of that for 30 and so a little profit a little bit more budget for me so as i said seal is broken already seal i mean was i opened it up let's take out yes and the first jersey is already the one with the flaw but let me tell let me show you i mean <laughs> when i saw this and to be honest um it was not the biggest when this came out, I still am not quite, but it's a mid 90s shirt. It's the Bayern home jersey worn from 93 to 95, where they played in the Champions League semi final in 95 against Ajax wearing this shirt. If you don't believe me, I have the official book from that season. And you see, when I saw that, I, I said, Yeah, I might as well get this one and maybe we can sell it on as well i have to say when i look at it this looks very much of the period note the different Bayern crest uh from today i mean it doesn't have the blue outline it also the um, lozenges are a little bit more level than they are nowadays which i find rather interesting but this is definitely from that period uh so, yeah i mean label washed out Every, this seems to be an original uh, the way I look at it, it's probably an L because it's a, it's wide, but it's not very um, it's not very long overall. And I said it has a flaw. Yes, it does have one flaw, and one that actually prob 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 probably is. Uh, yeah, we have to see. There is a hole here on the back side, um, which I guess will need some stitching up uh one way or another either with a patch i was actually thinking um you know there are those embellish uh, that nowadays it becomes a fashion to have embellished shirts maybe you know if you can uh sew this together and then maybe make a nice pattern around that not that i can do it but maybe i can find someone who who will i have to think about well what, what, what i'm gonna, gonna do but i have to say this is an amazing shirt Overall, I never liked the blue sleeves, to be honest. I think if that would have red sleeves, I would like like it better, but I really like the way the color is done. Uh, and I think the blue accents were uh, actually work for Bayern, although probably most fans would prefer white ones. So that's the first shirt. I would argue the second one is even better, but the, that's the one I already have in my collection and I have the other one out. Now, given that this Bayern shirt seems to be original, I think this one is too. And yes, it is. Although I have to check this against the shirt that, 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 that I have because there's an interesting difference. Uh, it is also an L. Same colors as the Bayern shirt, however, blue dominant. The 95, 96 PSG home jersey sponsorless version that's the one that they played in the european cup winners cup final 
and beat Rapid Vienna to my delight and to the dismay of most of uh, my classmates. It's an amazing shirt. This is for me almost the ideal PSG shirt. Now the one thing that I'm and I have the I have my version. I have this. This here is my version. You see, it has an Opel sponsor, and as an XL, it is decidedly larger. So we'll have to look at it. But wow, the R R C note here, the crest is kind of um, all plain. And this crest here has a slight silvery outline. And same goes for the Ile de France logo on the side here, which this one does not have. Uh, that is a curious difference, but you know, I uh, may have to do some digging on that. But yeah, let's hang those two shirts up. Amazing shirts, amazing price, I gotta say. Okay, I decided to put the Bayern shirt up uh, for the simple reason that I want to have the comparison between the two PSG shirts. Both of these are L and I tried them on. I mean, yes, they fit like L, but I have to say the size difference between L and XL is very, very noticeable. There is, it's a big, big difference. And even this uh, L here, it looks a little a little bit small. I tried to figure out whether this is maybe a youth L or whatever, but for that it almost seems to be uh, too big, to be honest. Uh, that's a little bit of a puzzle because you know the 90 shirts are big. I mean, I feel comfortably in both of these. However, the, uh, the uh, my original PSG jersey has a very, very baggy and very loose uh, fit and it covers well down so uh that is definitely in, in, in interesting um comparing those two i mean other than that those two are same material everything is very much the same so i don't have a doubt that these are not original uh they feel right i'm actually really pleased with this now the question is um do i keep it do i sell it on i think i will probably sell on this psg george jersey although i really like that it is without a sponsor to be honest, without the sponsor, it's a little bit more iconic since they won, won the European Cup final, but the other jersey is, yeah, is more mine. Let's put it that way. In any case, let, let, let me know what you think about these two finds. Uh, I have to say this was just too good. I mean, including shipping 20 euros for both of these is, an, I find, an absolute steal. And at least one will be sold on if not both of them for a little profit as i said i don't think i don't need both of these and probably i'll keep my old psg jersey and sell this one on. but yeah amazing stuff any case let me know if you had any finds like that uh re recently give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video subscribe to my channel if you want to see more talk to you soon bye hey there i really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the little bell icon so to get notified whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day. Bye!